Apple unveiled the much anticipated iPhone 12 series on Tuesday. The new series comprises of four new iPhone models, which are the iPhone 12, the iPhone 12 mini, the 12 Pro and 12 Pro Max. However, the iPhone 12 and 12 mini are likely to grab the most attention thanks to their cheaper pricing over the iPhone 12 Pro and the 12 Pro Max. The iPhone 12 carries a starting price of $799 for the 64GB variant while its 128GB variant is priced at $849 and the 256 at $949. In contrast, the iPhone 12 mini comes at a price of $699 for 64GB variant, whereas its 128GB and 256GB storage models are priced at $749 and $849 respectively. The iPhone 12 and the 12 mini both run on iOS 14 and come with the A14 Bionic SoC paired with 4th generation neural engine and a new 4-core graphics architecture. Both iPhone models also come with a notch that houses the true depth camera system for Face ID support. However, on the part of a major difference, the iPhone 12 carries a 6.1 inch OLED Super Retina display, while the iPhone 12 mini features a smaller 5.4 inch OLED Super Retina display. For photos and videos, the 12 and 12 mini both have a dual rear camera setup that houses a 12 megapixel primary sensor with an f1.6 lens and another 12 megapixel ultra wide shooter with an f2.4 aperture as well as a 120 degree field of view. Both new models also retain optical image stabilization support that has been a part of the iPhone family for some time. The new iPhone models also include the magnet at the back to support the newly launched MagSafe charging accessories. The iPhone 12 battery is rated to deliver up to 17 hours of video playback and the 12 mini battery is set to deliver up to 15 hours of video playback. I have to say that Apple has done a good job with both these smartphones and thumbs up for that. And I would recommend you getting the iPhone 12 mini if you are shopping with a tight budget because it definitely delivers for the price. But if you have $100 more, then iPhone 12 is not a bad option. It brings a bigger screen, lighter weight, slightly better resolution, and a better battery life.